Hey, Stephen, looking great, man. I love this. I think this is fantastic. Um, this this is going to be really great. I just think that th this layout, this setup is, is so much more effective. Um, okay, a couple of things. So uh, fine, let me see here. Just looking at your kerning. A little tight through here. Yeah, a little, little tight through there. Remember um, the cur the rules of kerning, you know, the tightest space is between two curves, then the next loosest is going to a curve and a straight, and then the widest space um, should be between two straights. So you have mostly straights right here. So, so think about that, how, how that, watch your kerning. I think you're a little tight. Actually, I, I'm going to go ahead and say, I think you're, 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 you're um, tracking. Um, I would open your tracking up a little bit because this is reverse type. Whenever you have reverse type, you want to open your tracking a little bit. I would open your tracking a little bit. Then I would go in and fine tune um, the kerning. Uh, for example, you're pretty tight in some areas. Um, so think about that. Remember those, those rules of kerning. Um, okay, at that point, what I would recommend doing is taking this George Bernard shot, moving it up a pixel or two, and presenting that in an italic, okay? That, right here, you're a little densely packed right here. So what I would recommend, you may, if you want to keep the, this position right here the same, just take this whole text block and move it up a little bit in the composition, because I want to, to create a little bit of space between the signature and this type setup. Um, I, again, move this up a pixel or two, set that in italic, then give up a good amount of space between um, George Bernard Shaw and the signature. Um, and then, the, and then we move to the back. Um, and I, I think this is going to be, this is looking really good. I'm not sure if that's your final color choices yet, but we're, we're looking, we're looking like we're going to have some interesting stuff here. So let's see where this goes. Um, I'm trying to think of, uh, let me kind of zoom in here a little bit. I want to check your typeset on those paragraphs. I'm getting a little bit ahead of us because this is basically still supposed to be the front cover. You know, as a matter of fact, I'm going to leave it at that. I think the, the front cover looks great. Let's concentrate on that right now. So let's go ahead and try those changes. Um, I think it's really going to be effective. That That's going to look great in italic, and then making that separation is going to give you a really nice setup here. So... Um, all right. Great job. Nice work. Um, if you have any questions, please let me know. Thanks, Stephen.